Hey guys, it's Nick from PC Hacker 11 here, and in this video I'm going to show you how to make a cool glowing neon text effect inside of Adobe Photoshop. This will work in Adobe Photoshop version CS3, version CS4, or maybe any other version, I'm not quite sure. I'm going to be showing you guys this today in version CS4. So what you're going to get once you do this basically is something like the text that I have in front of me right here. It's going to be having sort of neon colors glowing around your text. So without further ado, let's get started. So you want to open up Photoshop right here and we're going to go up to File and create a new document. We're just going to name it something. So I'm going to name it Text Glow 2 and I'm just going to have the width and the height set to my screen resolution. You can set the width and the height to whatever you want to. I'm just going to set them as my screen res so because that's just easy for me. So I'm going to click OK and make sure the background color is black. You can make the background color whatever you want to, but for the purposes of this, I'm just going to make it black for you guys. So anyway, what we want to do is first of all, make sure that down here the foreground color is white and the background color is black. So let's go down and make a new layer and then grab our text tool and start making some text here. So I'm just going to make mine PC Hack relevant make it sort of in the center here. And now here's something really important. You don't want to make your font too heavy or too thick. You want to use sort of a light font like this that's sort of thin so that the glow will stand out. So use a light font that's not too heavy and not too thick and you'll be fine. So I'm just going to stick with this font that I have right now. So now what we're going to do is we're going to go over here into our layers menu, right click on our text layer, then go to blending options. Then the blending options window should come up here. Just check mark the outer glow one for now. We're going to go ahead and change that later. And so now what we want to do is go down and create a new layer. And then we want to grab our brush tool. And we want to make the brush one of these brushes that we have here. I'm going to select mine as this brush right here. That's the 100. And so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down here and I'm going to change the foreground color to sort of a neon like green. Now what we're going to do is we're going to use our brush tool to fill in an area around the text that we want our neon color glow. So I want that area to be glowing neon green. And then I'm going to go ahead and change the color to sort of a neon lightish blue color. I'm going to start filling that in around here. And now I want the end to be sort of purplish, pinkish. So go in here sort of like a neon purple click on that and start filling in the area so now that we have our area like this with the three patches of neon colors that we want to make our text glow now we have to make it so that the glowing effect can take place so we have to apply a filter so we go up here to the filter tab go down to blur then go down to Gaussian blur right here click on that and then uh, depending on how you want it you can change the radius here like if you want it really splotchy and weird like this then a low ratings for you if you want it like to stand out like this then you want to have a high rating for the purposes of this video I'm gonna change it to around 41 42 around there I'm gonna click OK now that we have it like that so now what we want to do is go back into our layers again and here where it says normal click on that and then go down and click on color at the bottom and then it should look like this but however when you click on color make sure you're selected on the layer that you applied the Gaussian blur to so now that we have the color background glowing like that we want to go back to our text layer right click it and go to blending options again then we're going to go back into the outer glow tab but click on the outer glow tab and then here where it says spread and size we can change that to whatever we want to so if I change the spread to around 10, size around 18, the glow and the neon should look like that. So I'm going to go ahead and click OK on that. And that is what our text looks like. So I'm going to go over here and save that. So just save as text go to JPEG desktop. OK. So now we have the text glow to right around here. So if I click on that, 
this is what we get a cool neon glowing text effect so anyway this is how you make a cool neon glowing text effect this has been a quick video from PC Hacker 11 so I hope you guys like these videos if you have any ideas for new videos then please tell me I'm also gonna tell you guys a video on how to make a cool wallpaper like this a little later so anyway yeah, so anyway, this has just been a quick video from PC Hacker 11, so thanks a lot for watching, and I'll see you later.